It wasn't hers, it was mine. She said she was sorry and mom said I should forgive her, but I don't want to. She ate my candy bar. Oh my, you seem rather upset today. Is something frustrating you and not going your way? Casey, my sister ate my whole candy bar. Not just one little bite, but the whole thing. And now there's nothing left. It's not fair. Mom said I need to learn to forgive others, but I just can't. My candy bar's gone. Forgiving can be hard when someone has done wrong to you. Let's go on a Bible adventure and see what God wants you to do. All right, Casey, I'll go on a Bible adventure with you. Friends, will you go on a Bible adventure with me today? Great! Casey, I think we're ready. Flip the switch, you'll be on your way. A detective is what you will be today. A detective? Really? This will be so much fun! Friends, flip the switch with me. Count with me, ready? One, two, three, here we go! I'm Detective Spavin. Look at this. Look at that. Put on the yellow coat and the detective hat. Hi, Detective Spavin. We're so excited to be detectives today. I better grab my detective hat and my coat. Friends, I need to put on my detective clothes. Whoa! I look like a real detective. Will you be my junior detectives today? Great! Detective Spivin, I think we're ready. You're missing the most important thing you need. You must find the Bible so the story you can read. Look for the red apple and the Bible you will see. It is over there, not by me. Junior detectives, we need to look for the red apple. But first, I need to grab my magnifying glass. Whoa! Look at this! It's so big! <laughs> when you see it, say, I spy, I spy! Here we go! <laughs> hmm. I can't see it! Friends, do you see it? If you do, yell, I spy! Over here? Wowzy dowsy! You found the apple! I better open it up and see what's inside. Friends, look, it's the Bible. I just love the Bible because everything in the Bible is true. Now we can tell the Bible story. But before we do, we need to get ready. So let's click on our listening ears. You ready? Click, click. Click, click, and now let's put on our special eyes. Shakoom, shakoom. Great job, I think we're ready. All right, friends. There was a man named Isaac. Isaac was very old and could hardly see. Before Isaac died, he wanted to give a blessing to his oldest son Esau. A blessing was given usually to the oldest son. So Isaac told Esau to do something special. I think Detective Spivin has a clue for us. To find out what Isaac wanted Esau to do, find the tall giraffe. It is there you will find the clue. Friends, we need to find the tall giraffe. When you see it, say, I spy. Here we go. Hmm, it's not over here. Uh, I wonder where it is. Friends, when you see it, yell, I spy, I spy. I spy? It's over here? Wow, Z 
Dowsy, Dowsy, you found the giraffe. Now I'm going to open it up and see what's inside. Look, friends, it's a bowl and a spoon. Isaac asked Esau to make him his favorite meal. I wonder if he did. Detective Spy, they must know. To find out what Esau did right away, find the flower. A clue is there today. Friends, we need to find the flower. When you see it, yell, I spy, I spy. Here we go. <laughs> hmm, I wonder where it is. Junior detectives, when you see it, yell, I spy, I spy. You spy? It's over here? Now I'm going to open it up and see what Esau did. <gasps> Friends, look! It's a bow and arrow. Esau went hunting so he could make Isaac his favorite meal. I want to try this. Oh man, I hope Esau had better luck than me. Hmm. Esau, he had a brother and his name was Jacob. And Jacob's mom wanted Jacob to get the blessing. So she had a plan. <laughs> Detective Spivan has something for us. Jacob's mom told him to take the blessing from his brother. So find the campfire to see how he went undercover. Junior detectives, we need to find the campfire. When you spy it, say, I spy, I spy. Ready? Here we go. <laughs> hmm, I wonder where it is. Friends, do you see it? If you do, yell, I spy, I spy. Do you see it? It's over here. Wowsy, dowsy, you found the fire. Now I'm going to open it up and see what Jacob did. Whoa! Friends, look! Jacob took some goat skins and he put them on his arms because Esau, he had really hairy arms and he wanted his arms to feel like Esau's. But wait, there's something else in here. It's food. Jacob's mom made Isaac's favorite meal and gave it to Jacob so Jacob could take it to his father. It's Detective Spivin again. To learn what happened next in the Bible story, go to the green frog. The truth you will see. Junior detectives, we need to go find the green frog to find what the truth is. Will you help me? When you see it, yell, I spy, I spy. Here we go. Hmm, I wonder where it is. Junior detectives, when you see it, yell, I spy, I spy. You see it? The great frog's over here? Jacob took the meal to Isaac, and because Isaac couldn't see well, he pretended to be Esau. Here, Father, I made your favorite meal. Esau, is something wrong with your voice? <clears throat> no, Father, I made your favorite meal. Esau, it doesn't sound like you. Come here and let me touch you to see if it really is you. Here you go, Father. It is you, Esau. You brought my favorite meal just as I asked. Now I will give you my blessing. Friends, 
Jacob stole the blessing that was meant for Esau, and he tricked his father. When Esau got home, he decided to take the favorite meal to his father, but he found out that Jacob stole the blessing. How do you think he felt? You're right, he was so angry. Show me your angry face. Because Esau was angry, Jacob moved away, far, far away, for a long time. But one day, God told Jacob to go back home. But Jacob was scared that Esau would hurt him. But he decided to obey God and go back home. Let's pretend like we're going home with Jacob. You ready? Here we go. Place your hands on your knees. We're going, we're going, we're going back home. We're going, we're going, we're going back home. And stop. <laughs> Great job, junior detectives. When Jacob got home, Esau ran to go see him and gave him a great big hug. They were so happy to see each other. Even though it was hard for Esau to forgive his brother, Esau knew God wanted him to. And just like Esau, God wants us to forgive others too. That's Clocky. Hi, Clocky. Hello, friends. I have good news, I'd have to say. You've just discovered the special words today. Wait, really? Friends, did you hear that? We just discovered the special words for today. But wait, Clocky, what are the special words? The special words today are, God wants us to forgive others. That's great. Junior detectives, our special words today are, God wants us to forgive others. Will you say that with me? God wants us to forgive others. Let's say it one more time. God wants us to forgive others. Great job, junior detectives. That's Detective Spivin. You did a great job solving each clue. God wants us to forgive others, me and you. I need the coat and the hat, that is all. Now it is time to turn the wall. Thanks, Detective Spivin. Friends, I need to take off my detective clothes. Here I go. Whoa, I'm back in my normal clothes. That's Thumper. We better turn the wall. Here we go. Count to three with me. One, two, three. Hey, I'm Thumper. I want to say hi. Let's stand up, sing, and touch the sky. I'm going to reach, 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 and touch the sky. I'm going to jump, 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 and jump really high. I'm gonna wiggle and jiggle like I just don't care. I'm gonna wiggle and jiggle like I just don't care. I'm gonna spin, spin, spin around everywhere. I'm gonna spin, spin, spin around everywhere. Cause God, He loves me so. From my head down to my toe. He'll never, 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 never let me go. Cause God. Jump really high. I'm gonna jump, 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 jump really high. I'm gonna wiggle and jiggle like I just don't care. I'm gonna wiggle and jiggle like I just don't care. I'm gonna spin, spin, spin around everywhere. I'm gonna spin, spin, spin around everywhere. Wow, I really like that. 
that song. You know, today we learned that God wants us to forgive others. So let's take a moment right now and let's pray and ask him for his help. You ready? Place your hands out in front of you. Now open them, shut them. Open them, shut them. Give a little clap. Open them, shut them, open them, shut them, lay them in your lap. Repeat after me, friends. Say, Dear Jesus, thank you for our Bible story. Please help us to forgive others. In Jesus' name, amen. Casey, thank you for such a great Bible adventure today. You have learned that God wants us to forgive others. It's true. But I have another question for you. Should you forgive your sister for eating your candy bar too? Is forgiving others always the right thing to do? You're right, Casey. Today we learned that God always wants us to forgive others. I'm gonna go forgive her right now. Friends, don't forget that God wants us to forgive others. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, Riley.